to talk about it with Shaw and Key. Hello, everybody. How's everybody doing today? Um, we have a topic that we want to discuss. Um, and what is it, babe? Spiritual canteen. Spiritual canteen. <laughs> Wait, pause. <laughs> Wait, did you have a moment? <laughs> I had a moment. Spiritual right canteen. Around. Go ahead. Yes, yeah, spiritual canteen. Uh -huh. So um, I can't even remember how God dropped this or when he dropped it in my in my spirit. But <laughs> what he began to talk to me about was spiritual canteen. And I began to ask my husband since he was in the military about why do they carry those canteens? They always, I always saw that canteen around a soldier's neck or um, them drinking out of a canteen. And I was just like, why do they carry that canteen? Mm -hmm. Do you remember your response to me? I think my response was, is that basically the durability of them. Like, okay, when people go to war um, or different things like that, you can use them for more than one purpose. You know, they carry um, water, um, you know, just say like if you get into like a uh, like battle, they mm. e they're not easily destroyed and things like that. Yeah. And when he said that, God began to speak to me about mm -hmm. when we are we're a spiritual canteen, mm -hmm. like when we are um, in Christ, we are protected. That that I, I want to keep saying flask for some reason, mm -hmm. but the spiritual canteen, the canteens that they carry as soldiers, we are in God's army mm -hmm. and we as we're as we are presented with different things and we're we're with the like the canteen is durable we're mm -hmm. we are we are as we are connected to Christ uh -huh. and also what I was thinking about is I was just like the canteens they you know I thought that they kept them cool because mm -hmm. I have a canteen and my canteen is it keeps the 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 warm drinks warm or hot and the cool drinks cool she got one of them new modern ones so i thought that they yeah. the soldiers the canteen <laughs> not they at all <laughs> i did I, I thought that they kept it um cool and hot but he said that they were basically basically the durability and that just sparked that like god was like yes that's exactly who you are who who we are as citizens in the kingdom we are durable we have take we take mm -hmm. hits we take um and we come out stronger. We're mm -hmm. not easily broken right. as we are in Christ. Mm -hmm. So what, I mean, what do you believe as being spiritual canteens? What would you say in with your experience with just, you know, the canteen itself? Mm -hmm. You talked about the durability mm -hmm. and why would you say they would choose that one? I mean, maybe just durability, but why would, why did they choose that over anything else? And, and other things that you may have seen, like it happened. Has anybody trampled on it? Has it been kicked around? Or, I mean, cause mainly most of the times I saw people drinking, drinking with mm -hmm. it or either mm -hmm. hanging on their neck. Well, in my experience, I haven't seen anybody trample on it, mm -hmm. kick on it, mm -hmm. whatever on it. I just know them to be, um, just easily accessible. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So if you're out in the heat um and you just need to fill up with water you make it just run over and sh turn over the little faucet things they have sometimes mm -hmm. in training areas mm -hmm. and fill up with water and that's just something because you know. as you were saying that fill up with water i was just thinking about how we are filled mm -hmm. how god fills us yeah. so that we are continually um hydrated that we continue mm -hmm. to keep our set keep from as we spend time with the Lord, we are mm -hmm. continually um, being hydrated by by him. He's hydrating and refilling and filling us because mm -hmm. that's who he is. And that's who we are as kingdom citizens. Mm -hmm. So I thought about that. It just I mean, it's not a long word, but it's just a word that talks about the being spiritual canteens. And I saw the the, the symbolism in the mm -hmm. canteens that the military's the military has. And it thought I thought about right. that, which mm -hmm. is totally different from ours. Um, there are some canteens things that I like I have that are very durable but it's mm -hmm. one that I have that as soon as you drop it it won't keep it it, it can it has the, the capability and one of them have to lose that whatever that thermal thing is that mm -hmm. keeps it mm -hmm. hot mm -hmm. and it won't keep it hot but those canteens are durable just like you and I as we are connected to Christ we are durable we are he continuously refills mm -hmm. us just like we, he said he take they take that canteen and they mm -hmm. refill them with water God refills us with water and they may not be the nicest looking things, mm. but they are for us a necessity. Mm. Like when you're out, you know, training 
and things like that, they are basically a necessity. We need those so that we can so we can fill them so we can be filled. That's good. And then yeah. it, what, when you said that, I, I was thinking about how then after God refills us, yes. then we can go out and refill That's others right. because he has called us mm-hmm. to go out and to to reach the world, to go out and share his love with whoever we come in contact with. So as he refills us, like the canteen that they have, we're spiritual canteens, we then go and we infill others uh, in, the, in the sense of sharing and imparting. And sometimes God will use us to actually uh, lay hands on others. And mm-hmm. if they desire to be filled with the Holy Ghost, yes. then we will be those conduits that he uses to fill others. Mm-hmm. Hey, babe. Say, sound like she brought a good word. So, um, <laughs> spiritual canteen. Yes, yeah, spiritual, spiritual canteen. canteen. Just think about that when you think about the next time you pick up your canteen or see the canteens that the military um, people have, because those are the ones that I really saw that God began to speak yeah. to me about. All, All right. right, that's it. Until next time, blessings and peace. Mm-hmm.